Hey everyone, welcome back to the hospital. And to Cake with Hospital. Mm -hmm. Lock book. book. This cake is so artificial, I guess we we should throw the cake into the room next time. Oh yeah, it's I just, guess it will explode. explode, yeah. It's like a mass destruction weapon. Absolutely. I mean, um, it's extremely pink. Oh yeah, nail polish remover. And something that didn't reach. Something that was too fast, so we have to go into the inventory. <laughs> what did what, 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 A taser? Oh, we already had that one. Some gun battery. There was nothing here. Items. Perfume? Perfume. Did we get that? Probably perfume. That's notebook. Oh, we can examine it. We haven't watched that one. My dear Dalta. Hope this will never come to any use. Maybe it's better if you never know. More than anything else, I feel the possibility of you going away pop. But sometimes we have to tell the truth. That's why I'm writing this. We found lost in death and oblivion. What happened back then? That has something to do with who you are. It, start it all started 24 years ago. Coming back from a vacation, my wife and I found a baby on the side of the highway. Since we were childless, we thank God for letting us meet this child, this, this, this girl. We took her home and asked nobody, I guess. Yeah, exactly. Oh, baby, let's take it. Yeah. Bye-bye. Two years later, my wife died, and another four years later, 17 years ago, I came to Sound Hill. I heard the girl's pleas and took her with me, not knowing why she wanted us to go there. Well, I guess this is what children are like. Can we go to Sound Hill? Can we go to Sound Hill? <laughs> and it was there that the <coughs> girl went away. Not that she actually went anywhere, nor did she die. Return to her original style. That's what Dahlia Gillespie said. Or Jules Pie, like I read <laughs> <laughs> Jules Pie. I always read Jules Pie. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, Dahlia Jules Pie. <laughs> original style. That was a young woman burned by her mother and a sacrifice to God. A lesson. Go, kill us, Pie. <laughs> yeah, pie cake. Half a soul came to those flames. I went on to live with a baby in that girl of mine. Of yours. Ours. Oh, of <laughs> course. <laughs> Joe's pie. <laughs> Sorry, seven years passed before that half a girl returned. That half a girl, oh, okay. <laughs> returned to Silent Hill and made a lesser hole again. Newly strengthened. Give it a word. She vowed to kill God. Got a fetus nestled into the sacrifice sacrificial girl's womb. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're doing this too to bother me. I was summoned with, a re with the usual rites. This was a lesser's wish, no matter what the outcome. Even if her own existence squared stick. But that wish was not granted. My interruption meant she prayed instead for the girl's return. I alone couldn't bring her back. Dahlia did it. I only helped at the birthing ceremony, ceremony to bring God out of the letter. Okay. The newly born God wailed once and was dead. <laughs> That's a nice thing. No wonder what that. All of the girls and probably a lesser conscious resist. Conscious? Okay. Whatever. That's not the end. After God had vanished in a glow of light, Les reappeared and gave me a baby. She looked a lot like that girl so long ago. Babies all look the same. Well, yeah. And then Alessa was gone. <coughs> Dead. Yeah, and she wailed. There was nothing I could have done to help. I simply clutched the baby to my chest and ran off. <laughs> that sounds like, ah! <laughs> Sorry. The whole thing felt like a dream, but I had proof that it wasn't. The girl was nowhere to be found in my arms. The baby. Now 70 years have passed. It feels like only yesterday. And again, it feels like a million years ago. I confess I had reservations at first about raising that baby. Could I love her? Her existence was thoroughly, whatever, in unexplainable. Well, so is everything in this game, so why do you mother? I thought she could be that young woman who snatched away my beloved daughter. That led to sadness, anger. There were times when I put my hands around her tiny little throat. That's what I call father's love. Yeah. <laughs> Well, maybe he's home with this. <laughs> Several times I even consider abandoning <clears throat> yeah. her. Yeah, like, just let her lie there. Someone will take her. I yeah, guess. like she did one before. Just yeah. put her at the road. Why not? That's what a terrible person I am. 
but he decided to raise her, raise her after all. I just couldn't seem to let her go. When she, when you look at me, you laugh so. Even now I can't forget about that girl, but I love you. I have no doubts about that. That's all I ask you to believe. To my precious daughter, Harry Mason. Harry Mason is not the daughter. Yeah. <laughs> I just, so you know. Not that stop, 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 To my precious daughter. Stop, 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 break my brick. Oh, thanks. Wait. The locker is closed tightly. Okay. More closed tightly lockers. More whatever. Nothing more we can get here. A door? No. Oh, what, she, what is she looking at? Oh, she's looking at the door. <laughs> Let's leave this room. Let's leave this room. Yeah, exactly. Get out of here. I told you. <laughs> okay. Um, bum, 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 bum. Go straight into the right. Oh, yeah. We have a lot of doors here. Seems that away. Oh, there's something. Oh, more dolls. <clears throat> more to read. Ooh, nice. I'm so good with reading. <laughs> you might not have yet realized, but uh, your own true feelings. Well, sorry. You may not have ha not yet have realized your own true feelings, but you sent them unconscious. And so you're trying to get closer to me. That's the virtue, the path to paradise. Well, that's in the strip bar. Okay. And the door's locked open it. Wow. Sorry. Kingdom Hearts. You're the password for the prison gate. Doctor. I've forgotten his name. Anyway, that quest has posted. He should be here too. I mean, four numbers would have been good enough, but he kept on going. Isn't it a shame I'm not there? Aren't you irritated? I long for you, but you're so cruel. Still, I want you, Heather. Yeah, yeah, Sandy Coleman, whatever. Who else? Okay, this is a math riddle. It's Uni's part. If it's not the code we already wrote down, it's Uni's part to, to find that out, and I will check the doors. Yeah, wait a second. <clears throat> there it is. Yeah, but I need, maybe I need to set them to okay. a sheet of paper. So there's a typewritten memo posted there. What's that supposed to mean? The first is larger than the second? Yes. yes. It's the same. The second twice, the third? Yep. The third smaller than the fourth? Yes. The fourth is half the first. Yes. Okay. Then the right answer is. Um. Should be eight. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Um. Eight. Eight. Six. Three and four. I think I. I'm gonna have to do it again. I think I just failed. Eight. eight six. Three, four, yeah, and it's on Great. Okay, before we go in there, I have to check out the other doors here. Lock broken. Lock broken. Elevator. Let's see if there's anything else. Um. Yeah, only the door. Staircase. <clears throat> and the stairs. We don't have to. Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Did I just... Oh no, it's closed. I thought you were in the linen line on oh, never. No, it looks like there was something. Okie dokie. Let's gay go gay here. Oh gosh. Hey, chairs! Uh, Why do they have bar chairs? And that's doctor's chairs. Oh, okay. They look like bar. Okay, they're too small. We found bodies. Bodies in the poetry. <laughs> <laughs> Tart three my re. Oh, start time is my key. <laughs> oh, okay. Do we wrote that down? Yeah. Oh. But I, th I thought I, I when I was looking at it, I thought, okay, star time is my key, tattoo. What do, do I mean by that? <laughs> what do, now I know what I meant. There's a medical record here. Could this be for this dead guy? 
Background unknown. Name age unknown. Not admitted patient. Found in poor mental state on hospital grounds and temporarily unstalled in room M4 at Chief's discretion. Died late tonight from blood loss due to sev severe carotid artery. He cut his something? Okay. Was um, grasping uh, his throat. Okay. Was grasping own kitchen knife in right hand. Assumed this way was cause of neck wound. Possibly suicide, but wound, wound angle suspicious. Sent to second floor treatment room for further investigation. Have received no proof of corroboration of event from patient residing in in same room. Have not notified police. However, for future necessity, leave victim's bed and effects intact. Room M4. I just, I just wonder. Huh? They have no information about this guy, right? Okay, you just take a look at his arm, and from his arm, you can already already tell he's male and he's older than thirty. Yeah. And they don't have even any information. I mean, what kind of doctors are they? They don't. I don't know. <laughs> I don't like them. Yeah, maybe maybe they could ask for someone if he's from here. And if he was a patient there, why don't they have any records about their patient? Yeah, uh, yeah, they they could they, they should at least know what blood type he is. Yeah. Maybe some eth some ethnic stuff. Oh yay! It's ringing. Well, I turn off the alarm yet. Wait a second. It's twenty past four. What was it last time? I have no clue. I can't say it. I, I don't know. I didn't write it down. So, 420 is unlocked. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Work pretty fast. Yay, we got an instant camera. Okay. Perfect. I forgot what we need. Oh, I know it. That's uh, good. Want to oh, go. there's another letter. You want to take a, ma a nap? Yeah. And another doll. <coughs> Did she wear a pink dress? I don't really remember her wearing blue. I remember her red. Yeah, well, <laughs> there was a tattooed guy on that rumpled bed. Not anymore, though. That alarm clock and filthy back are his. Ah, but don't misunderstand. I haven't done a thing. I didn't hate him, though he was a liar. Should I write something on my own? On my chest, since I can't cut it open to you. Show you my heart. I love Heather. No, something a bit more forceful. I love Heather isn't enough for what I feel, or the what tender emotion this image brings. Stanley Cole. <laughs> so nice that he always uh, uh, makes this signature. Yeah, I kind of feel like in the episode of Criminal Minds when they when they give you a sentence and then they say from who it was like. Yeah, from the freak. No, they like. Mm -hmm. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Leaving. Okay, I'm thinking about it. Shall we do it again? Maybe there's something in there. If that, we have to check it out. You know, I mean, well, there's something in it. Wait, wait, well, why? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm just scared that you know. Oh, they don't turn up like this. Is this part of four where they stand up again? Oh. Okay, so the three really stand up again. Why are you asking again? <laughs> I just her off that possible. Well, she usually takes her time. Right? Maybe it depends on it does. how hard they are damaged. Oh, she's dead. I just stomp her a little more. <laughs> yeah, just don't oh, stand up! <laughs> I will have my revenge. Okay, we get a first aid kit, and that's it. I just, uh, start to hate the nurse rules here. Okay, wait. I'm gonna re... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, we have a lot of ammo for this one. I think that's okay. If we have more space between us and the nurses, perfectly fine to have the... Yay! Handgun. Televisions! Take them! We need weapons! Yeah, great! But well, stupid thing is we can't use them. <laughs> Unlock us. Okay, so we were here for... 
Oh, that's where that guy was. Right? Yes, it was. So we went into the wrong direction again. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, now I think we have to go down and use the nail polish remover to get the key out of the wall. I'll go to Hillary. We don't care about you. <laughs> Where did she come from? Well, maybe she was returning from a break. Let's go to three. Doesn't work. Okay, so we have to go back to one and then we get a key. Maybe the clock collapsed. Yeah, like everything here. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> the floor is broken. <laughs> yeah. The floor is broken. You cannot open it. Uh, it was. Whoa. I'm a little drunk. <laughs> Ooh. No, I guess if I was a fountain, I would start to drink. Wait a second, I have to see where it was. Oh, C2, we're already right, say No, no, C4. C4 is. Isn't that a room? Yeah. Okay. I want C4 too. We could just think it. We could just. Yeah. Bump the wall. Okay, let's try it with the nail polish thingy. Um, items? Yeah, it works perfect. I used the nail polish room. I got a stairwell key. Whoa! Ooh. We are so good. So, where do we go from here? We go to the room where we can save. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> that's a good idea. <laughs> that was just a little idea of mine. <laughs> I'm happy that I had the right one. Bye, nurse. Bye, nurse. <laughs> no nurses in a safe room. That would suck. Yeah, it would. Oh, blah, blah, blah. What the hell? It our first run through took us five hours and four seconds. Do we do that time? Mmm. <laughs> Get even more than normal. Well, probably because uh, we, we missed the map the first time. Yeah, so that kind of. That fun. was a major suckage. Yeah. <coughs> okay, down or up? You can decide. I hate down or cool up. <laughs> okay. We have to go down either way, so. So we can unlock this one first. No, I thought we'd gotta unlock it. We have been here before. So we go to number three since the the elevator doesn't go there. <clears throat> yeah. Luckily the nurse can't use doors. Is there actually a a game where the enemies can use open doors? I'm not sure. Not the one. Oh, that roof! I think I passed the third floor. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Here we go. Jump, jump, jump! I also like the rooftop. It makes me want to fly. Yeah, fly! You too? Uh, <laughs> no. Okay, what's happening here? Uh, oh my god, I think it's something. Yeah, there is something. But oh my god, it's huge! I just saw it, I just didn't know it. I thought, I thought it was Pyramid Head doing it. <laughs> No, Pyramid had it. Yeah, that's why he wants to fly. But he's a whoopsie. Yeah. They're even taller. Uh, I just want to go in there. Okay, I think uh, we won't go there again. <laughs> yeah, lock is broken and there was nothing else. Okay. Yeah, so maybe there was something like a thingy package, but I don't think that it's necessary to get it. I think we will we will lose more health. Yeah, exactly. While we're searching for it. That's why I don't want to go there. Yay, more. And now there's the ultimate weapon on the roof. <laughs> like, oh no, flamethrower. Machine gun. Grenade. <laughs> okay, we're in the freaky guy section, I guess. The lock is broken. Unlock. Yay. Why couldn't could we unlock it? Ooh. What are you doing here?
for some reason I just thought I got the freaking guy still here. <laughs> okay, anything here. No. Just the ammo waste stuff. <sighs> and rust. Yeah, rust. A lot of rust. You were everywhere, weren't you? Yeah, he was like, I'm running around, making dolls, and throwing... And, and, he, and he always uses another book! Not not only a sheet of paper, he's always using a book! That's nice! <laughs> yeah, you can read all of it again. Flung freely, your ebony hair, like the night sky, scattering fragrance. My heart glamouring in my chest like a storm, you trifle with it. You pristine, pristine, whatever, glance? Like a feast when you smile. My thoughts disturb my breath like op opium, opium, whatever. It drives me mad. It drives you mad. <laughs> Drove. Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Eric. Eric. Okay. A great poet who conveys my feelings so well. I shouldn't have let this place get to me. Should never have gone crazy. Well, who <laughs> should? <laughs> but it's superbly enjoyable to drown in my love for you. But why won't you accept proof of my love? Don't stand on ceremony now. After all, you and I exist as one. What I give to you is the same as what you give to me. Nothing? I'm not sure if I want to know. But actually, why are we here? I don't... When we were here with James, there was stuff written on the wall. No beer and no tea. <laughs> makes James go a mess. <laughs> makes, makes, makes James go crazy. I guess it was. Hello, would you go up there? Thank you. So nice. And over. <sighs> I kind of saw it coming. Um, yeah, this. Is Why does it work now? Do we have two elevators? Yeah, we have two elevators, but this was the one I was trying to, uh, well, here's this one, or what's this one? I want to get out of here. Press the button. Okay. <laughs> it's so, I don't know. Okay, that's where the idiot section was. <laughs> the idiot section. <laughs> it's locked. Want a key? Um... <laughs> Wait, what? Well, I, I have something written on it. I just don't know why we got it. Where we got oh, it from? Yeah, well, we don't have it. Let's let's just first find out why we have it. Funny thing is, we've been everywhere. Oh no, store room. Yeah, they worked. <laughs> <laughs> That's an idea. Oh my god, and another save point on the floor this time. Uh. Sever. No, it's sewer. I know it's sewer. Hospital storeroom. Oh, more of him. He's annoying. Oh, I can't even read it. I can't. Oh, I can't. <laughs> Just have to be in the right position. She's like her father. Have my most sacred lover. I, I just read my most scared lover. I thought, how many do you have? <laughs> I'm always watching you again. Yeah, no, I would be scared. No matter where you are or what you may be doing, I have never lost sight of you. I know we feel intensely lonely, yet with a single key to this door, those feelings won't stand in the way any longer. We haven't been able to see each other for so long. Be patient. It's just a little longer. I'll be patient too, even though I long to hold you in these hands of mine. The key is behind the shelves in the underground garage. <laughs> Why there? Ask the idiot doctor. There's not a single person here who's right in the head. Not just in this hospital. I mean in all of San Hill. True, true. Okay, that's a lie. <laughs> Except me. <sighs> Maybe we're starting so well. Oh, yay. We probably need it. No, I know where we get the key for the door from. I from just the basement. Don't, I, yeah, I just think the problem is that um, it, it's different every time. Oh, okay. So, let's go to the basement. <laughs> the basement. I don't know what it's in French. No one ask me. Yeah, you never had French. I had French in school and I can't remember. <laughs> well, I had French for two years, but only uh, uh, 
Sorry. For uh, for fun, like you know, fun, fun, <laughs> <laughs> really big fun. Yeah, and right. I don't remember anything. There's for some reason this the basement looks cleaner than anything. Oh, yeah, it's a wheelchair. Who is spinning the wheel? Uh, the wheelchair itself. It's um electrical. <laughs> yeah, maybe it can uh, can uh, can drive the 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 hole up and down. <laughs> You really want to know where the person is? Well, actually, according to the position, it must it must have fallen into the wall. Uh, well, or it oh, well. got smashed by the door. Hello, I want that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what the heck is a submachine gun? I don't know what a machine gun is, but what's a submachine gun? Maybe half automatic. I don't know a submarine. Maybe you can shoot it out of water. A submarine gun. <laughs> Okay, yeah. The thing is that we get the code from here. Okay. Yeah, you see blood? Yeah, like, totally interesting. Streaks of blood? I read something. <laughs> yeah, stakes of blood. Bloody stakes. Mmm, yummy. As if something got dragged, are continuing on the back of the shelf. No, it's more like they start from the back of the shelf. So, yeah, the thing is here, it's actually pretty easy to know this. Let's just use this one. And. Yeah, then she doing it like this. I would actually, I would be too, would be too afraid to look at the picture because I would, I would be so afraid that there was a nurse staring, like, <gasps> you know. So, I, I would so throw this stuff away. One nine five six, different one, right? Yep. Right. Because last time, I guess we had we had no one in it. Okay, she's looking at the board. But yeah, let's uh, check out if there's something in here. The plot drive continues into the elevator. Part of me wants to peek in, but then it's a little creepy too. Just do it. Oh, she does it. Oh. Scared from the girl. Beginner. <laughs> you need. <laughs> I <know. laughs> I wouldn't look in this elevator for a million. I would have to go to the third floor, right? Yeah. Third floor. I think we should stop here. I think we have to cut this episode into four. Okay, how many parts do we already have? Uh, two. Okay, then we will stop it here and we will enter the code in the next episode. See you then. Have a nice day. Bye bye. <laughs>